President Trump says he's happy with how the results of the midterm elections turned out. The president says despite Republicans losing the House, he's optimistic that he can now reach legislative compromises going forward. Eyewitness News White House correspondent Mark Meredith has the latest from Washington. President Trump took a victory lap Wednesday, saying despite Republicans losing control of the House. I thought it was a very close to complete victory. The president says in many races, he made the difference. I did actually make a special trip for Andy Barr because he was in a very tough race in Kentucky and he won. For nearly 90 minutes, the president answered questions and sparred with some of the reporters at the news conference. That's enough. That's no, enough. Mr. President, I did, well, That's I was enough. going to ask one of the, the other folks. That's that. enough. Come January, the president will be sparring with a divided and likely hostile Congress. The president says for him, that's not all bad news. I really believe that we have a chance to get along very well with the Democrats. And if that's the case, we can do a tremendous amount of legislation. The president says he hopes to work with Democrats on an infrastructure reform bill, but the president admits politics might make it difficult. We asked the president, given Tuesday's results, what about his plans for his 2020 re-election bid? Do you want to lock down your ticket right now, sir? Will the vice president be your running mate in 2020? Well, I haven't asked him, but I hope so. Where are you? Mike, will you be my running mate? Uh, stand up, Mike, please. Raise your right hand. No, I'm only kidding. Will you? Thank you. Okay, good. The, uh, the answer is yes. Okay. Thank you, sir. President says he remains optimistic about his chances in 2020 and that if Republicans campaign on a strong economy, voters will flock to the GOP. In Washington, D.C., Mark Meredith, Eyewitness News.